Well, I think that uh, NATO is faced with uh, uh, two kinds of problems, among others. Uh, one is where it stands uh, with regard to its expansion, because uh, Ukraine and Georgia were on the agenda for the next uh, wave of expansion. Then Ukraine had a change uh, in government, and this was uh, removed as an per immediate perspective. And so this is uh, one, one of the, 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 the topics, which means also the relation with Russia b behind this issue of the expansion. And the other one is uh, uh, the whole uh, involvement of NATO in uh, so-called out-of-area operations because of the increasing impopularity of the Afghan war, uh, at least among uh, the allies of, of the United States within NATO where public opinions in most states are, are clearly opposed to, to the continuation of this war. The, the, the movement reached a peak in February 2003, uh, but to believe that this would have been enough to prevent the war, I think is uh, just based on a kind of illusion because the only place where a movement can stop the war, a U.S. war, is in the United States. And in 2003, the movement was important in the United States, but never to the point of representing the kind of uh, mass pressure that uh, contributed to uh, put an end to the Vietnam uh, War. So that's the key point. We have, we, I mean, whatever happens in the rest of the world is of very secondary importance to, to Washington. So that's the key point. Now, the problem is that the good point that we have to keep in mind is that uh, the, the war in Iraq, which started with high rates of uh, popularity, ended with very low rates of popularity. And this explains why the, 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 the Obama administration uh, came to, to power as an agenda of, of uh, you know, evacuating uh, military forces, U.S. military forces from, from Iraq. So, uh, and this is related to the fact, aside from the difficulties encountered by the United States, but this is related to the fact that this war has become very uh, unpopular uh, in the United States itself. So, on the contrary, I should say, these are uh, rather positive and good signs for the future of the anti-war movement that uh, after this uh, period created by, you know, 9-11, war on terror and all that, uh, there's a, a resumption of the, the hostility of public opinions, even in the United States, uh, towards uh, military uh, intervention abroad. Well, uh, Obama basically uh, is no uh, discontinuity with the Bush years, uh, contrary to what people believed. Uh, the, the real discontinuity happened in 2006 during Bush. That is when the, the uh, kind of uh, project that Bush, the Bush administration had for Iraq collapsed, uh, reached very clear failure. And you had a bipartisan uh, effort in the United States to change the policy. And 2006 was the turning point. And there were new policies imposed on the Bush administration, which also translated in the fact that the neocons were ejected. And even Rumsfeld uh, was, was ejected. And the fact that Obama kept the same secretary uh, for defense, Robert Gates, is indicative of the fact that Obama is a continuation of the last two years of the Bush administration, basically, with some changes, but basically. And the, 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 what they are trying to do is uh, uh, end the direct involvement in fighting in Iraq while keeping some leverage over the country and uh, securing some influence. And they did so uh, through buying uh, uh, the Sunni, uh, Sunni tribes which were the constituency, basic constituency of the so-called insurgency against the occupation. And they want to play on this divide and rule between Sunnis and Shia and all that to perpetuate their arbiter role in the country. And now they are trying to do the same in Afghanistan, that is to, to buy at least a section of the Taliban. 
because they know that, they, I mean, they can't militarily just, uh, they can't win. The, the Afghan, even Afghanistan is a very clear uh, example, illustration of that. Mm -hmm.